again as the majors have it right near their own blue line. Cunningham lifting it high in the air shoots it down near the Peterborough net it rolls right near the goaltender but didn't quite make it to him and cleared away by Peter Aston as we get two players here we go just inside the Peterborough blue line nothing has really developed yet it just started out as words Ben that looks like where it's going to end but Logan Hunter of the Peterborough Peets and Daryl Boyce of the majors having words there they started to get the sticks up but Nothing ever really happened, but they're both going to go to the penalty box just the same. So Boyce and Hunter, each team with a man going off here. 32 seconds remaining in the second period. This game brought to you by Andon Bath Center, a 2-2 tie here at the Peterborough Memorial Center. Pete's had opened up a 2-0 lead. Back in the first period, but the Majors came out flying in the second period. Fighting back and tying this one up. That's where we stand, and unless something happens very soon, we'll end up tied at the end after two periods. See Mark Flood, the captain of the Peterborough Peets out there, just uh, still having a chat with the referee. Trying to get things straight as to what that was all about, I guess. Finally, skating well, turns back again now. He's going to come back to report to the Peterborough bench. And we're all set to go the face off to the right of the goal. Now they're holding up the play again just a little bit longer as the linesman wants to say something to the referee. Now the Majors had too many men on the ice, I believe is what it was, but uh, heading off is Vettorelli just in time, and they, now they drop the puck. And the Peets get that puck from the faceoff, a weak pass across.